so we gotta be quick about this. A little quick trip out on the lake. See what kind of damage we can do. I got a good feeling. Got a good feeling, so we'll see. Hopefully the Lord above trusts us with a good day of fishing. I'll get back to you whenever we get to the spot. All right, cut the first one on the little, uh, uh, what's it? That's not ultralight, it's a uh, light fishing rod. It's my favorite ones. It's perfect, it's seven foot. Really nice for flipping up in there on these tiny docks, you know? But yeah, little eater channel cat, first catch of the day. Looking pretty good. I had another one, but he broke off, so yeah. They're out there. It just rained too, like um, literally just a couple days ago. So I knew I could come out here after that rain, come up on here. I saw this. This section of shoreline's got a whole bunch of debris on it from the rain. I knew there'd be catfish up in there eating, so I came up down here on the kayak. I've literally never fished this spot before. I just saw it coming by and had a theory and it worked. So that's kind of cool, but yeah. First fish of the day. Pretty good. Got the hook out. Little catfish. There it goes. Ah! Got me all slimed. Sun setting. So see if we can catch ourselves another one. Trick with kayak fishing is positioning. It's the big thing. As you can see, I'm just casting in the back. That spot right there. Just back up in there. About halfway. Terrible cast. I didn't mean to do it that bad, but yeah, you get the point pretty much. with these guys on camera. It's the goal right now. Just an inch up. Just kind of inching up. That's the cool thing about these kayaks is you can get really close to the spot without having to worry about spooking the fish. You just gotta be very patient and slow, methodical and quiet. That's what the hug is gonna do. Oh come on. I know you want it, come on. Take it under. Oh, let go. Could be a bluegill playing with it. Oh. He's messing with it. Hmm? 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 Come on. Ooh, he's a hard puller. Ooh, he's fighting good. Ooh. Get out of the dock, get out of the dock. Ooh, it's a bigger one. It was bigger than the last one. Oh yeah, for sure. He's like looping around doing the death roll. Just like that, y'all. We've literally been fishing for four minutes. Get another one. This was my third if I would've caught that other one. Get the camera down so y'all can see. Ugh. Ah, get me all wet. Here he is, folks. The infamous Mr. Catfish right there, Channel Cat. Literally right over there is where he was. Came up on him. He couldn't resist the worms, man. Just couldn't resist him. The water is cold, guys. Whew. Cold. He almost swallowed it. No, he didn't. Look at that. Corner of the mouth. Corner of the mouth. Wherever you want to hook him. See that? Wow, it's dark out here. It's the problem with fishing in the evening. It's not the best for filming per se do the lighting but we make do huh so we make do all right go dang it man this sleeve is all wet now all right well let's go see how many more of those we can catch all right so it's going down look at that guys it sure is going down on the lake pretty though. It's pretty. Oh damn. Oh, dang it. Oh, oh, he's taking it. Got him. Oh, this one's really head shaking. Whew. This guy's going crazy. Ah. I bet you all can't even see this. Oh, he's jumping. Look at him. Look at him. This guy is angry. Look at him. Right there. Corner pocket. That thing wasn't even in there for a minute. Another little channel cat. Where's that hook at? Oh, there it is. You good, bro? Making some weird noises. Oh, we're getting 
I don't want to get too close to the spot. All right. Look at that, bro. See? Just like that, it's my third one within 15 minutes. Pretty crazy. Sorry about that, guys. GoPro keeps wanting to film upside down. All right, here we go. Get you back up in there. It's not even really where I wanted it, but that's where I caught that last fish. This one gets taken. I'm literally on top of him. I'm maybe 10 feet away from my bobber right now, so that would be pretty crazy. So, let me get some distance here. Is going down. See, once the sun goes all the way down, it's gonna be then it's gonna be really difficult to catch these guys because I ain't gonna be able to see nothing. Let me look farther back. Dang, speaking about seeing nothing, y'all guys can't see Jack. Wow, sun really is going down. Look at this. Isn't the, pretty, the lake pretty though? Look at that. Oh, shit. Or shoot, my bobber's gone. Got him. Ooh. Oh, he came off. Dang it. That was a good one. Did you take it all? Eh, most of it. Let's try it again. <laughs> Just like that, guys. Y'all can't even really, y'all can't see anything. I feel so bad for y'all right now. Yeah, okay, yeah. Sorry about that. Go, that GoPro died. The chest, the chest mount died. That GoPro died. And then he came along. So this is the fifth fish, number numero cinco. Um, Another channel catfish. Look, he's got a big gut. He's been eating. Um, barely hooked him, as you can see. Barely got to him. But uh, yeah, this is how close I am to this dock. And the fish are literally right up in there. See, you see how easy it would be for somebody to come back up here and just take your stuff? That's why I don't understand why they pay the extra money. But anyway, there's the, yeah. Yeah, you can see it way better on the iPhone. But yeah, really pretty out here. The sun has set it. It's setting behind those trees, as you can see, but it's already set. So. It's literally nighttime, you know, that's literally a star right there. Stars are out. Um, yeah, and I'm over here with my fifth fish, out of worms, out of, out of battery juice. So, uh, yeah, but yeah, it's probably gonna be all for me. All right, guys, got the hook off. Send off the last fish for the day. There he goes. And of course, he tries to get me wet. All right. Oh, 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 oh,